again. Did an outro yesterday because the camera died and ran out of memory and this part. So what we done yesterday was we watched Happily Ever After and we met up with some people as well. So we made some friends from New York. And then we went up to Springs after that and we went back to the room. And today we are just going to um, some of the outlets today. So, yeah. So our lift is here now. Is it the white one? What's his name? Juan, and he is a five star. So we're going to the premium outlets where the Disney warehouse is and Bath and Body Works. Hello. How are you? Good. So we just got out of our lift. What was his name again? Uh, Juan. Juan. Juan was very nice. Yeah, very nice. Got us here in prompt time. And now we are at the outlets. So these are the outlets on International Drive. Done the other outlets up there. Which yeah. Too much of. If you can't hear, yeah, if you can't hear Bradley very well, this is International Drive outlet, so that's where we are. Right, we're on the the right track now. I guess we're just looking for the crowds. Where are the crowds? So we found the character warehouse, and as expected, there is a queue to get in. So we're now going in. Exciting. Now we've just been eyeing up something at the window and we're going to grab it right now before someone else takes it. That is a bargain. So it's $7.99. $7.99? Yeah. It's supposed to be... $20. It's supposed to be $20. So... What's, what's, how much was that supposed to be? Um, it's cost me $10 instead of 34 Wow. What a saving. Oh, the Mickey things. We were eyeing it up as well. How much was that? It was twenty-four. Now nine dollars ninety-nine. Do you want that? Good. So they have these youth socks, which should have been sixteen ninety-nine. Wow, quite cute. Plush toys, seven ninety-nine. Was nine ninety-nine? What's that? Oh, it's when. That is really cute. How much is that? Or how much should that have been? $26.99 is now $12.99. Not bad. It's really cute. It's now walking. Thank you. It's just typical, really. When we when we leave, it's dead out here. I <laughs> know. Oh, let's not walk us in the queue. So, how much did it come to? Sixty-four dollars. Which, when you think sixty-four dollars, yeah, it is a lot of money. But it's not a lot of money when you consider that you can probably buy like a jer the jersey that I bought was like forty dollars in the park. So. Yeah, we found it. I couldn't tell you how to find it in this place, but. Just uh, go around a few laps and I'm sure you'll... Oh it doesn't look too busy in there either. Ooh, and it smells so good. Excited. It does smell amazing. We had a look around. And what we're going to do is we're going to show you all the stuff that's here. So, we're going to start at the beginning of the shop and show you. So obviously bear in mind this is like all Christmas range now so if you come say in May or whatever it's going to be different I imagine. But yeah it literally it's so weird it feels Christmas music in this heat doesn't go. Some of the stuff is so cute. We won't show you what's in our basket. We're going to do like a I'm so sad already because I want to get so much more. Yeah, it gets so expensive quickly. It just smells so good. Mm. 
And that's so cute. Look at it. These are quite good. They're like hand washes, aren't they? That doesn't sound good. That's Shut amazing. Up. But there's no denying that, like, the US do, like, their shop displays are so much more better, aren't they? That's cute. Put like these, um, these go in these holders. So cute. And they are actually saying that they're ten dollars fifty. That's not too bad. Not bad. These candle holders are adorable. Again, twelve fifty. Not bad. Me and Bradley are indecisive if we're going to buy this one or not. We think it's quite cute. If we come back to the UK, we can't actually... You can't use them. But you can go on eBay and get some. And look how cute this is. Isn't that adorable? Like as a plug-in. It's just such a shame that we can't take them home. No, you should get like a converter, but... They end up costing a lot of money. This is where all my money's gone to, is the sanitizers. Look at the holders for them. Look at the holders. Isn't that adorable? Isn't that adorable? So you put these in the holders. Have a little interesting fact for our viewers. So I was speaking to one of the ladies about obviously these things and obviously buying the adapters in the UK were really expensive. And she was saying you actually can use these in really different like in um, oil burners and rediffusers. Oh really? So she said they're safe to use to like tip out into an oil burner and burn them. So if you can't, if you're from the UK you don't want to spend like 20 quid on a adapted version of a plug in. Yeah. yeah, but that would seem like they'd go quite quickly though, the smell, wouldn't it? So cute. Ah, oh, the room sprays, they are so good. Mm. So, yeah. Bath and Body Works. What you get, what's your guessing cost? Huh? What is your guessing cost? I about 110. Mm, I don't know. I guess, uh, I guess we'll find out. I don't really want to know. I think mine's not cheap, but actually bought a lot more than me. Yeah. He spent a lot more than me. So, I mean, I've just bought like. Bought five, seven, five, six, seven, and there's a couple of joint things we've bought together, but I haven't spent that much. We got this little bag one, it's really cute. Mm -hmm. So Jack chose the holder, and then I chose the candle. It's a champagne toast, which smells amazing. It doesn't smell too Christmassy, which is good. Grab the thing then. Grab the thing. So do you want to tell them uh, the damage, Bradley? No. $163 in Bath and Body Works. The cashier went, you're clearly from Britain before I like even spoke. <laughs> she was saying that only Brits spend that money. I mean, that's not. 
$163. But to be fair, like, just to put it into perspective for people, we bought like five air right room fresheners. We bought a candle, a candle holder, like 60 odd antibacterial gels, car air fresheners, room like room spray. How many, how many um, handbags did you buy? I got 28. 28? I got five. Last me a year. So we're just gonna get a bite to eat at Deluxe Burger. Um, and then we'll probably have a look around Springs for a little while. And then head back to the room. Get ready for this evening. Yeah, there it is. We've never actually had Deluxe Burger before, so it's be our first time giving it a go. So we believe that we can use our far, not our fast passes. We'll do mobile order pick up, so I'm assuming we can try that. Yeah. We'll do mobile order. So we're going to Ella's sandwich. We were going to go to, obviously, Deluxe Burger, but they didn't have a lot that I could eat other than sandwich, which included mushroom compote. And as everybody knows, I hate mushrooms to the point that when I go out, I say I'm allergic to them. Oh, that's a new one. Cool. Gray and BB-8. Oh, that's cute. Maybe it's cute. So we just got our Earl of Sandwich again. So you got the tuna melt and I got the Hawaiian chicken. And we do these now as well, which I've never seen before. The Reese's peanut and butter chunk. So looks good. Again, that's obviously on the meal plan as well. So you get the sandwich, the cookie and the drink, which isn't too bad. It's quite nice. Right, back at resort. Time to uh, chill out for a little while. So, I thought I'd give you guys a room tour finally. So. Dun 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 dun. So, I've got a little mini fridge with our shelving. This isn't what we're eating when we're here, these are like souvenirs and things we're going to take home. Have we? Um, TV. Lazy butt, the la uh, lazy Taurus on the bed. Oh my god! Turn it around. Booty of two. So sassy. So sassy. So we got it for nine dollars ninety nine instead of twenty four ninety nine, and we literally saw this in the park the other day. So it's so funny. What we'll do is we'll do a little haul for you after everything we bought today from the outlets. See the bathroom. Yes. See so that's pull down bed. Two more chairs. Hello, guys. This is a very muggy evening here in All Star Movies. It's very, very hot. We are on our way to Animal Kingdom tonight. We've got our three fast passes. We've got Dinosaur, Jenny, Flight, Flight, Jenny, Jenny, Jenny Flight, Avatar thing, and Everest. We've also been given a couple more fast passes from the hotel due to a couple of issues we've had with them, but nothing too major. And I'll wear my Disney top I got from the outlet today. Don't know what Jack's wearing. From top from Primark. Oh, sorry, thank you. From top from Primark. Oh no, it's super dry, that's a lie. And um, one bad habit that Jack's got at the minute is leaving our backpack open. Bearing in mind it has all of our money in there and our ID. And we're almost gonna probably be late for our first fast pass as well again because Jack takes so long to get ready. So yes. 
I believe our bus is on the way. One thing I've noticed, people say, oh, the buses are not very good here in All Star movies and All Stars all together, but the bus has been perfect. We've been really lucky. I don't, I don't know what people are on about. Here it is now. No figment. We promise it's another day. They're not just dancing forever. <laughs> this is definitely another day. <laughs> Then we got Pandora, Fly of, Fly of Everest, Fly of Passage. And then Everest after. And then Everest after. That's sort of like going back and back. We do, that is not wise to do that. So we're literally going from like one end of the park oh, no. to the other park <laughs> and then to back to the other side. Probably not the best. And we're going to dinner with someone else tonight. So that'll be fun. Someone who works for Disney. Just done a fast fast bit, so we're now going to head through the queue and get on Pandora. Oh, get on Flight Passage, shall I say. The theming is very cool. Is it the first time? It's exciting. No worries. Welcome to the Avatar program. Soon, you're going to have a chance to undertake an amazing Navi ride of passage, flying on the back of the So, I do apologise. Just jumped from Animal Kingdom to here. So, we went out for a meal at the um, restaurant in Pandora. The restaurant in Pandora. It's very nice. We had a... Uh, a make-her-own bowl, that protein bowl thing. Yeah, make-her-own like, noodle bowl, protein thing. Really nice. Granny had tofu. Yeah, it's only second time I've ever had tofu. It was actually quite nice. And now we've got... So... The cupcakes from our resort. So our resort's known for their cupcakes. A couple that is. Fantasia cupcake. Fantasia cupcake. And I've got a pumpkin spice cupcake. Let's see. Tell them what it's like. I'm scared. I don't know what this is. If that's just frosting or if it, I don't know what that is. It's like a chocolate mousse. So we're now back in the room. Feeling tired, as per usual. I know that's the usual excuse that I give because it's me. So tomorrow we're going to Universal, so we're going to have an early night, and yeah, that's it. Night.